That was a good workout, wasn't it? Very much so. <laughs> you had some pretty good moves there. I did. Uh, Lady Ali taught you a lot, uh, didn't she? She sure did. Uh. She sure did. Well, we've got a champion here with us. That's right. He's a business champion. Well, you know, yesterday it was announced that Yahoo purchased the popular blogging mm -hmm. website Tumblr for $1.1 billion in cold, hard cash. Cash. And here to discuss all the intricacies of the deal is Arise Entertainment, U.S. business reporter, correspondent, Editor of business, oh, Andrew boy, Smirch, the, the money there. man. Our money champ. <laughs> yes, Thank you for money not champ. asking me to jump for open box. <laughs> <Yeah. by the laughs> stick to the numbers. I stick was exhausted just <laughs> walking there. <laughs> so, so oh, Andrew, gosh. first of all, for people who don't know what Tumblr is, what is Tumblr? And it, it has no E, right? Oh, yeah, it has okay. no E. Let's start okay. there. So learn how to spell it first, T-U-M-B-L-R. Gotcha. Uh, it is a okay. blogging site for those who don't want to actually spend too much time blogging and writing. It's oh. uh, a microblogging site, so a few sentences here and there, pictures and video. Oh. And it has now about 109 million blogs that what? it says it hosts, which is an unbelievable number. It has totally caught on. Now, is it true that the creator is only 26 years old and he's a high school dropout? He's a high school dropout. He's a uh, native of the Bronx mm -hmm. and he went to Bronx Science. And I know Bronx Science. I had friends who went to Bronx Science. And uh, you have to be pretty smart to go to Bronx Science. And okay, this kid is an true. absolute genius. He dropped out of Bronx Science uh, to be homeschooled. Oh. Uh, he never went to college. Uh, and he was born in 1986. And here's what's interesting about being born in 1986. If you take the numerical value mm -hmm. of the letters Tumblr, uh -huh. it comes out to 86. Uh -huh. So he is a pretty uh, He's pretty, pretty creative. Smart kid. Look at that. That's right. <laughs> so tell us about when he exactly started it, how long it's been around, and how much money, most importantly, will he walk away with after the big deal? So it's been around for several years now, mm -hmm. and it's reported that he will walk away with $240 million from this deal. Wow. And, Are you and, kidding? And, <laughs> yeah, That's pretty bad. good for a high school dropout. Yeah, <laughs> Uh, and Why did I waste my time going to college right. and graduate school? <laughs> when you could have started See. a blog site. Gosh. Uh, you know, the, the, um, the interesting thing here is that um, Tumblr doesn't make any money right now. It doesn't make mm. a lot of money. So now Yahoo has to figure out how to monetize it. I don't know how they came up with a $1.1 billion valuation, which is what Yahoo paid for this site. In cash. In cash. Not even stock. That's right. Well, they, why cash? Why do you think it was a big important? You know, there may have been some negotiation going on. Mm. You know, maybe they feel that Yahoo stock isn't as worth it, you know, mm. $1.1 billion. But I don't know. You can't really necessarily say that. Mm. Yahoo stock is up quite a bit. Mm -hmm. uh, but they were obviously enticed to take this. When at, uh, for some time now, they've turned down various offers because Tumblr has this sort of, you know, cool factor that every, mm -hmm. every of these sites start with and everything. And they say, no, 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 we're never going to get bought out. And then someone comes along with a billion dollars. <laughs> <laughs> and that always and helps. That <laughs> so this is a sort of a huge gamble for uh, Yahoo's new head honcho, Marissa Meyer. Yeah, so, so my, I mean, she, Marissa has been on the job for about a year now. Mm -hmm. And uh, she's considered a rising <laughs> star. She has revitalized the brand. She has convinced people to come back to work for Yahoo. But it is still a sleepy old school internet site. You know, it's hard to imagine that an internet company is considered a passe, but that is kind of Yahoo's, uh, mm -hmm. the, um, the, the brush on Yahoo right, right now. And so this is a very big gambler, gamble for her. She needs to take some bold moves, and this is a bold move. Yahoo sits on a lot of cash, so a billion mm -hmm. dollars is a lot, but it's not all that much mm -hmm. uh, in Yahoo's mind. So she needs some hits here, and she feels that she can get it from actually expanding. Yahoo has been unsuccessful in making their own brands. Um, they tried a blogging and social networking site. You may remember GeoCities. Do you remember GeoCities? No, not at all. Geo Sorry. <laughs> you know, they kind of like that just disappeared one day. Goodness. And so they um, they need to get into the social media space, and this is a big acquisition that they could do quickly. Well, they're mm. both very popular sites, but how much is the audience expected to increase by Yahoo now buying them? They're out? talking about a 50% increase because really? of Tumblr's, the number of eyeballs on Tumblr. But you know, this is a very sensitive number. You have all these eyeballs today and, and they disappear tomorrow. Yahoo was mm. once the number one search engine to be displaced by Google. So it's a tricky situation. They, um, what they're really after here is not just the increase in eyeballs, they're, they're after Tumblr's young audience. Got you. Okay. And uh, Tumblr brings a significant amount of young audience to it. Now there's some interesting uh, takeaways from this because uh, Marissa Myers was on a conference call yesterday, an investor call, and uh, they asked about one of the uh, more sensitive areas of Tumblr. Tumblr is known largely for carrying quite a lot of pornography. What? And, uh, really? and her answer was, uh, we're going to let Tumblr be Tumblr. Oh, so okay. they, that means that they're probably going to be open to keeping it on the site. 
Interesting. Which is not has been Yahoo's practice. <laughs> Shannon is like, what's that site called? <laughs> I have a list here. By the oh, way, no, no, name, I'm good. So. I'm good. <laughs> but no, I do have a question about the Part fact that they sold it in the first place. And is that maybe? I wonder if that has something to do with the fact that they decided to sell it to Yahoo because they're going to keep it as Tumblr because they've been positioned to sell it to other companies, other big websites that wanted to buy them out. Well, Yahoo says, "quote We're not going to screw up Tumblr," uh -huh. uh, and I don't know what that means. Uh, but what they are going to have to do is they're going to have to monetize. Tumblr and what that mm. means will be advertising and that has always been the tricky part you know when Facebook was started Mark Zuckerberg mm -hmm. said you know we're not going to take advertising exactly. and of course at some point you have to you have investors they want to earn money and the only real revenue source for these guys right now is advertising mm -hmm. you know they can maybe put games on there and some other apps but it is largely going to be an advertising model and that could impact Tumblr well, speaking okay. of games, let's talk about the new Xbox. Yeah, Xbox mm. prequel. Do you uh, are you a gamer? I'm not. Right. I did <laughs> see some of the reveal though. It just happened today. They revealed yeah. the new Xbox system. So right? they, they revealed it in two locations because mm -hmm. not one wasn't enough for, uh, <laughs> for Microsoft. Uh, <laughs> Xbox is a significant driver of revenue for Microsoft these days, and so they're out with the new Xbox. It is Xbox One. Xbox and um, the key components here is it's going to come with 500 uh, gigabytes of storage space, mm. a uh, Blu-ray drive, and a faster processor for even better graphics and a new controller. This is the leader in game consoles mm. right now, but uh, PlayStation, Sony's PlayStation is right behind it, breathing down Xbox's and Microsoft's mm. neck. So they're trying to stay ahead here. So it's, a, it's an interesting development. Um, they've sold 70 million of these so far, not of the new ones, but uh, of, since its debut. The Xbox 360. Uh, yeah, the Xbox 360. Uh -huh. Goodness. So they want to make this sort of the center of your home entertainment. This S thing can do everything. They want, yeah, that's exactly right. They want to make this where you go for your one-stop shopping from mm -hmm. entertainment. It will have connectivity to cable. Mm -hmm. You will be able to download... Uh, D, you know, not DVDs, but you'll be able to download movies from yeah. various sites, possibly from Netflix. Netflix. And of course, it has internet connection because you need to be able to, uh, you know, play your friends mm -hmm. in um, various boxing. Um. So it's <laughs> like everything will be filtered through and be able to connect with the Xbox to work. Yes, mm. and so this takes it a step ahead right now. The um, elusive Apple uh, iTV that we right. keep hearing about. Yes. So Microsoft where is, is trying to. I know where is that? <laughs> That's what everyone is asking. So they're trying to stay a step ahead there. So tell us about the new games. We got to know about the new games associated so with this there, box. There's <laughs> right now a little bit of a shortage of new games, as ah. there tends to be. Call of Duty is the uh -huh. big one out uh -huh. there. I've heard of that game. Um, Everybody plays that one. Uh, FIFA 14. So a okay. uh, popular soccer game. It's a soccer game. And yeah. um, some family-friendly games. But now you need to ramp up to create new games, for, which will come very quickly. And mm. that's where all the new revenue that's also comes from. the money from. comes from. And they're expecting a, a big bump in sales, right? Because they have such a loyal audience. They have this huge loyal customer base of mm -hmm. gamers. They sure do. Yeah. They people actually line up for these games. It's, mm -hmm. it's, it's, yeah, it's incredible. <laughs> Get outside. Get outside. Line outside. Right. <laughs> Take Run a boxing outside. lesson. I agree with you. I agree with you. Well, but. let's just hope that they do not come out with another system next year that we have to go out and buy. <laughs> let's just stick to this one for a while. Well, Andrew, thank you so much thank for you. being here. And you're coming back again soon, I'll be back right? Tomorrow. Yay! All right. You're watching Arise Entertainment 360.